JCSAT-16 is a geostationary communications satellite operated by SkyPerfect JSAT Group and designed and manufactured by SSL on the SSL-1300 platform. It has a launch weight of 4,600 kg 10, a power production capacity of 8.5 kW and a 15-year design life. Its payload is composed of Ku band and Ka band transponders. Sky Perfect JSAT Group plans to use JCSAT 16 as an in orbit backup satellite for the Ku and Ka band satellites serving the Japanese market. SpaceX's Falcon 9 Flight 28 propelled JCSAT 16 to a geosynchronous transfer orbit on August 14, 2016. Topic history In April 2014, SSL announced that it had been awarded a contract by Sky Perfect JSAT Group to manufacture two satellites, JCSAT-15 and JCSAT-16. The latter would be an 8.5 kW satellite with Ku band and Ka band payload for a broad range of orbital locations. It would be used as a backup to the existing fleet. On September 10, 2014, JSAT announced that it had signed a launch service contract with SpaceX for the launch of JCSAT 16 aboard a Falcon 9 rocket. On April 3, 2016, it was announced that Kratos had been selected for supplying a 9 m Ku band antenna for JCSAT 16 TT and C at its Superbird Platform West Ground Station. Also, it was stated that the satellite had passed the critical design review. On July 13, 2016, SSL delivered JCSAT 16 to the launch site in Cape Canaveral for launch processing and integration. This was the second launch of the year for JCSAT and also the second time the company used the SpaceX launch services, both times also happening in 2016. On August 4, 2016, JSAT announced that the expected launch date of JCSAT-16 was on August 14. At the scheduled August 14 at 5:26 Coordinated Universal Time, SpaceX successfully launched the JCSAT-16 satellite into a 184 km x 35,912 km x 20.85 degrees orbit on a Falcon 9 rocket. The first stage successfully landed afterwards. At 5:58 coordinated universal time, the satellite separated from the upper stage. The satellite manufacturer SSL announced that 33 minutes after launch, the satellite was in good health and sending signals, while JCSAT-16 was supposed to serve as on-orbit backup at the 124 degrees east longitude position. It will be repositioned into service at the 162 degrees east position to replace Superbird B2, a satellite past its design life. Originally SUPERBIRD-8 was supposed to replace Superbird B2, but a mishap during transport to the launch site in March 2016 meant that it would be delayed between 1 and 2 years. On late September 2016, parts of Falcon 9 second stage re-entered the atmosphere and landed over Java and Madura, Indonesia. Some parts like the helium COPV composite overwrapped pressure vessel landed mostly intact and damaged an animal enclosure but there was no further damage or harm. Topic See also List of Falcon 9 launches